to take some time now to prepare for communion. I know we do it once a month at the beginning of the month. And I pray that uh, we don't do it superficially. We don't do it haphazardly. We just take this time and do it as the Lord would want us to do it. And that would be, the first of all, check ourselves. I'm just going to read what Paul said about this. He said, therefore, whoever eats this bread or drinks this cup of the Lord in an unworthy manner will be guilty of the body and the blood of the Lord. But well, let a man examine himself, and so let him eat of that bread and drink of that cup. For he who eats and drinks in an unworthy manner eats and drinks judgment to himself, not discerning the Lord's body. So what we want to do is we just want to take a minute and just kind of examine ourselves. This is my body broken for you, and as you eat it, remember me. This is my body broken for you. same manner, he also took the cup after supper, saying, This cup is the new covenant of my blood. This do as often as you drink it in remembrance of me. As Brother Steve. Father, once again, we thank you for this holy representation of the precious yes, shed blood of Christ that was not only shed for our sins, but was for the institution of the new covenant, yes. which is a covenant of better promises. Yes. which you want us to have in this life. Yes. We thank you for the blood that made it possible. Jesus. And we
Yeah. 